Have you ever wondered what it would be like playing modern games on a TV that's over 50 years old? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how I hooked up this Zenith black and white sub standard resolution monitor into a gaming computer from 2019. So not only is this TV in black and white and the resolution sucks, it only has one mono speaker. So this is going to make it hard to understand where enemies are in the game. Before we get into some gameplay, let's take a look at how I hooked this up. So uh, starting with, we hooked this up to the VHF uh, input on the TV, and we converted that over to Coaxial RF, which goes over to this converter box, which I got at Goodwill for about three bucks. This converts the RF signal over to an RCA signal. So with this RCA signal, we go over to this converter box, which takes the RCA signal and turns it into an HDMI signal, and then that is plugged into my gaming computer. Okay guys, here it is, Fortnite Battle Royale, loaded up on the 50 year old TV. If it looks like crap, I'm sorry, because it looks like crap in real life. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's give it a shot. Um, I'm gonna go out and say here that I am not the best at Fortnite, uh, but we are gonna give it a shot. Hopefully we can get a couple kills in here and uh, maybe even uh, win a match. I already can tell that this is going to be quite a challenge, mainly because, oh my goodness, we are awaiting, uh, I can't even read the text on the screen, um, I'm a, I think that's a gun, oh, we're getting them, okay, so uh, I guess it's drop time, uh, I, I can't even read what the hell is going on here. Uh, okay, so I don't know where my team is. I'm just... I can't see... Okay, I think they're over, they're over here. Okay, so let's, let's try to meet up with them. So I can say right off the bat, the frame rate is excellent, the response time is also excellent. It's not something you would see in today's monitors, but the resolution and the quality of the video is absolutely terrible. Uh, hopefully, alright, we got a gun. So it's possible to get a kill here, maybe. As you can see, the map is not in screen as well as some other options on the HUD, and this is because this screen is actually not square. Oh, shit. Somebody could be right on me, I wouldn't even know. To be honest, it's really hard to even figure out what's going on here. Y'all gonna come over here? And that's how it ends, gentlemen. So Fortnite didn't fare so well on this TV, and that's to be expected with the low resolution as well as the lack of colors. It makes it hard to understand where enemies are as well as even read text. Uh, it's basically impossible. But I do have one more trick up my sleeve. I'm going to try Apex Legends out on this monitor, and I'm more familiar with this game, so let's see if we can get some kills. It's basically impossible to play video games on this monitor, but this video was a fun look back at what times were like 
back in the 1970s. Uh, I wonder if in the future they're going to be making videos about today's technology and incorporating modern games onto a, 20, a television from 2019. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're interested in content like this, be sure to subscribe. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to go play Fortnite on a better monitor.